It's almost seven o'clock. We got up early at six o'clock this morning so that we could get ready. Goal is to be out of town by seven because Sharon said that, or put out on her post that we'd be there at 10 to start the Lottie Moon packing. Looks like everything shut off. Alexa, goodbye. Cleta says no food for tonight. All right. We're in Billings. We're at the uh, the state office. They have a mission dorm over here where pastors can stay, so that's where we're going to stay tonight. But we're going to go down here and start stuffing envelopes for the Lottie Moon Christmas offering. So for some of you that may not be Southern Baptist, uh, the Southern Baptist Convention uh, works together. It's a cooperative effort to support missionaries and we have international missionaries and we have uh, North American missionaries and uh, every year around Christmas there's a Lottie Moon Christmas offering that is taken and that money goes directly to missionaries nothing is used for administration or anything like that and uh, the IMB International Mission Board supplies those materials for churches and so the WMU Women's Missionary Union is heavily involved in making sure that that gets to the churches so since sharon is executive director we get to stuff envelopes <laughs> So we got done packing all that stuff and I made a, an appointment to come down to a place down in downtown Billings to get my beard trimmed up, which I hadn't done in a long, long time. I think she did a pretty good job and uh, plan on uh, coming back there, going back there again and try to do it a little more often, make sure I got it all nice and trimmed up and not looking homeless. but. The name of the place is called Rebels and Razors. Uh, pretty cool little little joint. Uh, enjoyed it. Everybody was. It's not like a salon where you go in and it's, you know, this was masculine. Even though uh, most of the folks cutting the hair were were ladies, but I had uh, uh, Addie. I think she owns the joint and uh, did just did a great job. I, I think it looks good and enjoyed uh, enjoyed getting my beard done up there. We're at the Krispy Kreme. Sharon's app says there's some kind of special here of... Can you see that? So, because uh, of the stupid COVID, we can't go inside, so we're waiting in line. Look at this line. And we're just out riding around. We got done packing. I went and got my beard cleaned up. I told you about that already. And then uh, we're waiting to go to our fancy restaurant tonight to meet with our meeting. Are we going back to the office first? No, probably not. My meeting tonight is uh, with the potential new president of Yellowstone Christian College and so we're meeting there and it's a really nice place we're going to and it was kind of like a business thing and uh, I'm trying to talk Sharon into going but she's wearing like ghost pajama bottoms they're not their leggings they're not pajama pants so she's like I won't fit in in that restaurant But I'm trying to talk them into it. We're waiting on an answer. 
few of you may know that I was a volunteer firefighter for many years and uh, you know it was kind of an ongoing joke about fire hydrants and knowing where they are and how close they are to certain houses if only there was some way that we would know where a fire hydrant was I don't think I've ever seen a giant sign fire hydrant well where is it oh there it is yep just in case you needed it we stopped here in the parking lot I talked Sharon into going to uh, the dinner tonight but she didn't want to wear her leggings so we got her some stuff to change and now she's changing in the parking lot we're back in the mission dorm we ate at a really fancy place called Jake's had good meeting but we're glad to be back Sharon's having a donut look we got these uh, told you we went to Krispy Kremes Krispy Kreme there's no S but we bought this uh, Halloween version look at these things a Halloween pack and the boys are in bed and I'm getting ready to make a video who won't spank first? Nobody. Nobody? No. Okay, go to sleep. Alright, I'm going to make this video and then we'll see you guys tomorrow.